Hello everyone and welcome to the first part of my let's play of Mass Effect 2. Uh, obviously I just finished the first Mass Effect so this is going to be an important save. I am playing on the PC just like the original. So let's jump into it. I'm going to import my Mass Effect 1 character. Now I think it was this one, level 35. In fact I'm pretty sure it was. Um, let's jump into it. A loading screen. Hurry up. Okay, I'm going to be playing on casual because I want to, you know, basically, I want the, I want to show everyone the story. Um, subtitles, yes. Squad power usage, yes. Auto save, yes. Okay. Uh, service history, name, yep. Yeah, I am going to be playing as a soldier again. Paragon, yep. I just want to check all this. Rex did survive, Ashley was killed, and the capsule was lost. That's exactly what happened. Shepard did everything right, more than we could have hoped for. Saving the Citadel, but leaving the Council to die. Humanity's place in the galaxy is stronger than ever, and still it's not enough. Humans may control the Council, but Shepard remains our best hope. But they're sending him to fight Geth. Geth. We both know they're not the real threat. The Reapers are still out there. And it's up to us to stop them. The Council will never trust Cerberus. They'll never accept our help. Even after everything humanity has accomplished. But Shepard... They'll follow him. He's a hero, a bloody icon. But he's just one man. If we lose Shepard, humanity might well follow. Then see to it that we don't lose him. Disengaging FTL drives. Emission sinks active. Board is green. We are running silent. We're wasting our time. Four days searching up and down this sector, and we haven't found any sign of Geth activity. Three ships went missing here in the past month. Something happened to them. My money's on slavers. The Terminus system is crawling with them. Picking up something on the long range scanner. Unidentified vessel. Hmm. Looks like a cruiser. Doesn't match any known signatures. Cruiser is changing course. Now on intercept trajectory. It can't be. Stealth systems are engaged. There's no way a Geth ship could possibly. It's not the Geth. Brace for evasive maneuvers! Get everyone onto the escape shuttle. Joker's still in the cockpit. He won't 
Evacuate. I'm not leaving either. I need you to get the crew onto the evac shuttles. I'll take care of Joker. Shepard! Liara, go. Now. Aye, aye. Well, fuck. Mayday! 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 Normandy is completely screwed. Normandy. It's kind of sad, really. I spent so much time in the previous game in the Normandy, and now it's just gone. Come on, baby, hold together. Hold together. <coughs> Sorry, guys, I've got a cold. I apologize for coughing in your headphones. Okay. I am walking very, very slowly to the bridge. A little faster. Come on, Shep. I did not mean to skip that. The Normandy's lost. Going down with the ship won't change that. Yeah, okay. Help me up. How the hell Shepard didn't just disintegrate upon entry into the atmosphere, I don't know. But, there we go. Commander Shepard has been recovered. The Lazarus Project will proceed as planned.
Okay, I'm gonna stick with the um, default ship. I'm gonna be playing as a soldier because basically my playstyle is basically just run and gun. Um, I'm not a huge. Well, I don't use powers very often. Um, so basically, I just rely on guns. So we're gonna play as a soldier. And I'm gonna take armor piercing ammo. Accept. Let's go, let's get into the game. So yeah, like I was saying, I don't really rely on powers too much. It's normally just guns for me. He's reacting to outside stimuli, showing an awareness of his surroundings. Oh my god, Miranda, I think he's waking up. Damn it, Wilson, he's not ready yet. Give him the sedative. Shepard. Don't try to move. Just lie still. Try to stay calm. Heart rate's still climbing. Brain activity is off the charts. <sighs> Scott's pushing into the red zone. It's not working. Another dog. Now. <sighs> Heart rate dropping. Stats falling back into normal range. That was too close. We almost lost him. I told you your estimates were off. Run the numbers again. Back from the dead, bitches. You don't have time to wait around, Shepard. Grab your weapon. And the I managed to put my armor on in less than we'll two seconds. From. Damn it. Those canisters by the door are going to keep your head down, Shepard. Shield yourself from the blast. Someone's hacking security trying to kill you. Look for a thermal clip for your pistol. Okay, have I got armor pissing ammo? Shove that on, why not? Looks like they set up a Gives the weapon a bit more of a kick. Look out. Keep moving, we need to get to the shuttles. Okay, let's roll. Shepard, security mechs are closing in on your don't take any chances. Stay in cover while you take out those mechs. Anymore? Yep. Stay still. Nice work, Shepard. Hell. Okay, we've got another thermal clip down there. Let's go grab that. Through there? Huh. I'm not gonna waste another grenade on that, so I'm gonna switch back to my pistol. Take the elevator down one floor. Hurry! Get to the door! Run! You're doing great, Chef. Head to the next room and I'll try to beat you. Chef, you freed me. I've got this closing in on my position. Yeah, let's see what we got. Whoa, hello. Please don't blow up. They do sometimes blow up. Okay, what's here? The progress is slow, but subject shows signs of recovery. Major organs are again functional, and there are signs of rudimentary neurological activity. Look update. The cost of this project is astronomical. Over four billion credits so far. I hate 
hate the hacking mini game. Yeah, this hacking mini game was probably fun for the first five minutes and then it got really annoying. Okay, where are we heading? This way. In fact, the music seems to be a little bit loud, so I am going to lower the volume. Because I don't want to get done for copyright. Now that sounds really weird now. I'm going to have to move it. That's too low. Let's put it at 50%. There. That's not too loud, not too low either. Yo. <laughs> Fucking overkill much. Did it really take a rocket launcher to kill that dude standing there? Fucking hell. Yeah. Oh, hello, Joker. Yeah. Power. What are you doing here? I thought you were still a work in progress. Are you with Miranda? Yeah, sorry. I forgot this is all new to you right now. I'm Jacob Taylor. I've been stationed here for- Hostiles detected. Damn it! Things must be worse than I thought if Miranda's got you running around. I'll fill you in, but we better get you to the shuttle first. What's with the mechs? Security. Usually they fight for us. Somebody must have hacked them. That should be impossible, unless you've got access. We've got to get you out of here, Shepard. I know this isn't the best time, but I'm sick of stumbling around when I don't know what's going on. Fair enough. I'll give you the quick version. You and your ship were attacked and destroyed. You were killed. Dead as dead can be when they brought you here. Our scientists spent the last two years putting you back together. You've been comatose, or worse, that whole time. Welcome back to your life. This doesn't look like an Alliance facility. It isn't. I can't say much more than that for now. The Alliance officially declared you killed in action. The whole galaxy thinks you're dead. And if we don't get to those shuttles, they'll be right. Were there any other survivors from the Normandy? I'll tell you what. You help me finish off these mechs, and I'll play 20 questions with you all day. We're low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give the order when you want me to hit them with the good stuff. <laughs> I didn't give the order, but whatever. Okay, now, Jacob. You're falling back. Okay, I promised I'd answer your questions. What do you want to know? The last thing I remember is the Normandy blowing up. Did anyone else make it? Just about everybody survived. A few servicemen from the lower decks didn't get out. Navigator Presley was killed by an explosion. But everyone else, including the non-alliance crew, the Asari, Liara, and the Quarian, they all made it out alive. Do you know what any of them are doing now? I don't know, Commander. It's been two years. They've moved on. Left the Alliance. Could be anywhere. They were my team. If they knew I was alive, they'd come back. Maybe you can track them down after we get off the station. If we get off the station. What's the quickest way to those shuttles? Depends where the mechs are thickest. It's probably best if we- Check. Check. Anyone on this frequency? Anybody still alive out there? Hello? Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. Just took out a wave of mechs over in D-Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell- Never mind. You need to get him out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. Let's get out of here. You bet. We can get into the service tunnels through this door. Let's roll. You're up. Damn it! Room's crawling with mech. The whole station is crawling with mechs. I'm doing the best I can. Whoa! Find us another route out of here. Oh God. Wilson. Server room B. Hurry. Shepard, down here. Bastards got me in the leg. 
You were there the first time I regained consciousness. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> How about we talk about this after we fix my leg? Should be some Metagel in the first aid station on the wall. Hopefully there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the Metagel from the first aid station on the wall. Unity. Thanks, Shepard. <clears throat> Never thought you'd save my life. Guess that makes us even now. I thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs, but whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio wing. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot! How do you explain that? You're all strangers to me. Let's get someplace safe, then we'll sort out whose fault it is. Right, Shepard. We need to find Miranda. We can't leave her behind. Forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where is she? Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Then why did you wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. The shuttle bay is only a few... <clears throat> we can overload the canisters to clear a path to the okay. shuttle. Okay. Have a nice trip! Wilson, you overload. Thank you. That's it. Let's get out of here. Okay, we took him down. But this is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, will you trust me? This really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if he's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project. The program that rebuilt you. It's funded and controlled by Cerberus. I think I ran into Cerberus a few times while I was investigating Saren. Some kind of pro-human splinter group, right? Well, that's what the Alliance wants people to believe. But there's more to it. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, I'd be suspicious too. But right now we have to work together. I thought you deserved to know what's what. Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. I promise. I don't care what they did or what you say. I'm not working with terrorists. You can tell it to the boss. But after we've saved up. Okay. Let's quickly hack this data pad, see what we can get from it. Okay. Let's go. They've seen us. Nah. Fuck. Okay, where are we going? Oh, we got more max. Have a nice trip. There we go. Let's head out. Come on, through here. We're almost at the Miranda, but you were... Dead? What the hell are you doing? My job. Wilson betrayed us all. Even if you're sure, did he deserve that welcome? He sabotaged the security systems, killed my staff, and he would have killed us. You sure about that, Miranda? We've known Wilson for years. What if you're wrong? I'm never wrong. I thought you'd have learnt that by now, Jacob. You should have taken him alive. See what he knew. Too risky. I've put too much time and effort bringing you back to life to let you get killed now. 
You really think Wilson's capable of that? Not anymore. If you say so. What's our next step? We get on the shuttle and go. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Lying to the commander isn't the way to get him to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? What about the rest of the people on the station? This is the evac area. If they're not here now, they're not coming. We can't leave without knowing for sure. We need to go back and look. Don't you get it? The only one worth saving is you. Everyone else is expendable. She's right. We all knew the risks when we signed up. Without you, there's no point to any of this. You're the Lazarus Project's director, aren't you? That's right. I put two years of my life into this project. Into you. What does Cerberus want from me? Maybe you should ask the elusive man when you meet him. He poured virtually unlimited resources into Lazarus. Obviously, he has some kind of plan for you. Where are we going? Another Cerberus facility. The elusive man is waiting for you there. I'm not sure I trust you. This is the only shuttle off the station. You want to stay and rot with the mechs? Be my guest. I've had enough of this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on. Let's go, then. Before you meet with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. Come on, Miranda. More tests? Shepard took down those mechs without any trouble. That has to be good enough. It's been two years since the attack. The elusive man needs to know that Shepard's personality and memories are intact. Ask the questions. Did you say two years? I've been gone that long? Two years and twelve days. And you were on an operating table for most of it. The sooner we start, the sooner we can be done. Start with personal history. Okay. Records show you grew up on Earth. Tough environment, no parents. You enlisted, and you survived a Thresher Maw attack that wiped out the rest of your team. Do you remember that? I lost a lot of friends that day. Going through something like that changes you. It can break you, if you let it. I read the report. Fifty Marines died on a coups. You were the only one who lived. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. Vermeer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility, you had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave her behind? I left a friend to die that day, and I didn't do it casually. But I had to save as many people as I could. Ash gave her life for the rest of the team. Without her, I couldn't have stopped Saren. She died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that cloning facility had to be destroyed. Shepard, think back to the Citadel. After the Council died on the Destiny Ascension, and you killed Saren, what happened next? With the Council dead, humanity stepped into power. We formed a new Council. I recommended Captain Anderson to lead it. Yes, Captain Anderson is now Councillor Anderson. Though from what I hear, he preferred life in the military. Still, good to know that the human Council member isn't going to put politics ahead of defense. Your memory seems solid. There are other tests we really should run. Come on, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. The memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. <laughs> Alright, well that's going to be it for today's the episode, guys. Waiting for you in the other room. Don't interrupt me. That is it for today's episode, guys. So, thank you guys for watching. Welcome to Mass Effect 2, and I will see you guys next time. Take care.